top of the morning again mates. I am a YouTube atheist, and today we are going to educate a particular Christian troglodyte, a lesson in respect. As stated previously, if we have any candy asses who can't stand profane language, kindly check yourselves out of here, as I have zero fucking time for complaints about a few well-placed, colorful metaphors. Cussing is my right as an atheist, for in supporting freedom of speech, I am free to speak like a total jackass. This particular flat earth believing, anti-science, pro-creationism douchebag goes by the name Shock of God. He apparently has a fixation with motorcycles, and makes a regular habit of professing his idiotic, backward, Christian faith for all the world to see. Lately, he has been posting really fucking annoying videos demanding proof and evidence that atheism is accurate and correct. It is a pity that both Mao and Stalin are not with us anymore, as they had the proper approach in dealing with annoying creationists who won't keep their pie holes shut. You listen to me, you knuckle dragging, redneck pile of horse dung. We do not need any proof or evidence that atheism is accurate and correct, because it is a self-proving, infallible axiom that destroys all arguments. It is a testament to our superiority as humans, especially in comparison to you superstitious, God-fearing simpletons with your invisible pink unicorns. It is a well-established fact that atheists, unlike all other lesser homo sapiens, evolved from a superior genetic code that like the rest of the universe, miraculously just sprung out of nothing six trillion bajillion years ago. Evolution is science, it explains everything, and anyone who says otherwise is dangerous and needs to be locked up for denying the Holocaust. How can you even ask such a silly question, when you have no proof for your garlic drenched, spaghetti monster, or his goofy hippie son, except some stupid book? I'm tired of hearing about your stupid book, and want to see it banned, burned, and replaced with the healthy diet of Darwin and Hawkins. And stop saying that great thinkers, like Albert Einstein and Isaac Newton believed in God. They might have said it, but they didn't mean it, because no one who believes in science can believe in God. Shut up or I will shoot your invisible bearded man out of the sky with my potato gun. Every time I hear one of you six day worshipping cooks, you remind me of how sad I was when I found out Santa was not real. Why do you keep bringing up this painful part of my past, do you want me to cry? There is no Santa, Tooth Fairy, or Easter Bunny, so there is no God. The conversation is thus over, shut the fuck up. This concludes our lesson for today, you stupid Jesus freak. I hope you learned it well, and stop asking that annoying question, because it makes my otherwise flawless, atheist skin crawl. I, am a YouTube atheist, and Shock of God has officially, been owned.